what's up everybody welcome back yeah i know it's been a minute hey it is what it is <laughs> no i'm just joking all right man so all right man with the time that i have taken off from this um i came up with something else something new for the channel and it's called conference playoffs now this don't include a traditional playoff tree per se just something i came up with with my own twist and i think y'all the viewers and college football fans like it i don't mean for y'all to love it i mean for y'all to like it you know what i'm saying so anyway it consists of pretty much putting two conferences together and go head to head so i'm from georgia so of course i'm gonna represent the sec and we just gonna run pretty much a gauntlet of all the power five conferences um i think the first conference we will do will be sec versus acc now how i'm gonna do the uh tree is based upon who won a conference championship so in this case 2017 2018 is the roster we will be using all right so it goes like this just a quick rundown of it um since georgia won sec they will play whoever won the particular conference or whatever we plan for the next conference so in this case we're gonna be taking on clemson all right then the runner up which was Auburn they're going to take on Miami so this is how I'm going to do the uh, whole um, conference playoffs so to give you a quick rundown of the SCC ACC games for this particular series now I am going to continue the Vanderbilt series the, pretty much the whole season has been played I just got to edit the videos and upload so y'all give me some time on that i'm gonna get those up in a minute but these are the games as follows um now another thing i'm thinking about doing i don't know y'all leave it in the comments section before i play the first game now i'm thinking maybe whatever side the conference champ is on that's the side that plays the uh the east side of the sec since georgia won the sec uh the sec title so uh, an example, like I said, ACC, the Atlantic, that whole side is going to play the SEC East. Um, Ohio State, the East won it, Ohio State, so we're going to play the whole East side in the Big Ten, um, and so forth and so forth. Now, with um, the Pac-12, um, I don't know, I probably, I think um, USC won it, so I think they're in the South, so we'll play that whole conference and vice versa now um i will uh include the uh final record for each team before we play so like for instance clemson they went seven and one in conference in acc play and they went 12 and two overall now another thing i'm thinking about doing is since um clemson and miami they uh, played in the uh, ACC championship game. Then you got North Carolina State and Virginia Tech pretty much runners up behind them. So um, the top four teams in each Power Five conference, I'm going to put them in a BCS bowl game. So for instance, Georgia and Clemson are probably playing maybe the Sugar Bowl or the Orange Bowl, or, you know, something like that. Just the top four teams in each conference when we play them. So bottom half of um the conference like syracuse went two and six in the acc and uh finished four and eight overall so you know they ain't gonna get in the bowl they just gonna play wherever they play at so what i'm thinking about for that will be like um they're gonna be playing uh um one second i lost train of thought all right, so Syracuse is going to play Tennessee. Tennessee went 0-8 in the SEC play this season, and they finished 4-8 on the season. So Syracuse, Tennessee will play. So whoever has the better record conference-wise gets the home. So 
in this particular game since Syracuse won two ACC games it'd be a home game for Syracuse and a away game for Tennessee you see what I'm saying like the next game Vanderbilt will be taking on uh, Florida State Florida State has the better uh, conference record they won three uh, conference games to Vanderbilt won so they get the nod they get the home game so that's how it's gonna go um, like I said if y'all think y'all can come up with any other little key attribute to add to this on top of this that would be helpful but I want to get a game up over the weekend because um, next weekend is my birthday I'm going home to Georgia for a week or so and it's just gonna be craziness but I gotta stop in Atlanta at some of my family so uh <laughs> it is what it is but uh yeah man y'all let me know I'm gonna try to get this video up today which is Friday so if y'all let me know sometime between Friday and Saturday night I can go ahead and get a game played um and I'll get it put up before I leave next week to go home so um that's that but uh, let me go ahead and give y'all a rundown of the first uh, conference playoffs. So, you got Georgia taking on Clemson. North Carolina State taking on South Carolina. Wake Forest is taking on Missouri. Boston College taking on Kentucky. Uh, Louisville taking on Florida. Florida State taking on Vanderbilt and Syracuse is taking on Tennessee. Now that's the East and the ACC Atlantic Division. Now, um, the SEC West and the Coastal Division in the ACC is as follows. The teams are uh, as, as they go like this: um, Auburn taking on Miami, Alabama taking on Virginia Tech, LSU taking on Georgia Tech, Mississippi State. Is taking on Virginia, Texas A&M is taking on Duke, Ole Miss taking on Pittsburgh, and Arkansas is taking on North Carolina. Those are the games. That's the way they're going to be played. Uh, I might play the last four games. Last four games is going to be Georgia, Clemson, South Carolina, North Carolina State, Auburn and Miami, Alabama, and Virginia Tech. I'll probably play... I'll probably mix those up, but I'm going to get the uh, the bottom of the um, divisions out first. So you may see Tennessee, Syracuse, or you may see Arkansas and North Carolina first. I don't know which one. Y'all leave that in the comment section. Once again, the first two games is between Syracuse, Tennessee, or Arkansas and North Carolina. Y'all leave in the comment section which one of those games y'all would prefer to see first. Now, between those first two games, um, it's a mix-up with Arkansas and North Carolina because they both went 1-7 and seven in conference play. But Arkansas has the better record overall, so Arkansas gets the home game versus North Carolina, and Syracuse gets the home game versus Tennessee. So that's it, man. That's going to wrap this one up, man. Y'all stay tuned. See y'all later. Peace.